I'm Steve Crane, Customer Care Consultant for Wirecare.com. Today I'd like to talk to you about assembling and disassembling Deutsch DT connectors. To assemble a Deutsch connector, you'll need a properly crimped wire, a plug or receptacle housing, a proper wedge lock to lock in the contacts, as well as the wedge lock tool or a flathead screwdriver. To learn more about making a proper crimp, please click the link in the description. Once your wires are properly crimped, you can now start inserting them into the housing. As you can see, we've already got one inserted. I'm gonna go ahead and put the other one into the housing. All you're gonna do is slide the contact into the back of the housing, push until you hear a snap and a click. Wire snaps right into place and your wires are secure. Now that your wires are in place, it's time to put the wedge lock in to lock the contacts in place. The best way to do this is with a pair of needle nose pliers. As you can see inside the housing, there's a small groove for the wedge lock to fit. Go ahead and take your wedge lock with the flat part facing back. Take the pliers and go ahead and insert the wedge lock in the place. Once it's there, you want to go ahead and push the wedge lock so it snaps in. Now you can use the needle nose pliers again, or you can take your tool, your contact removal tool, flathead screwdriver, and push that into place. And there you go. Now the contacts are locked into place, everything is safe and secure. Like the receptacle side of the Deutsch connector, the plug side also requires a wedge lock. This wedge lock is orange in color and fits in the plug side. Simply take the wedge lock, slide it into the groove, and snap it into place. That's it, you're ready to go. Deutsch connectors are easy to use, rugged, and environmentally sealed, making them ideal for use in automotive, industrial, and marine applications, among others. Disassembling the Deutsch DT connectors is just as easy as assembling them. First thing you want to do is start by taking out the wedge lock. Here we have a plug. It's going to slide the flat end of the screwdriver underneath the wedge lock, give a little twist, and it pops right out. Once you remove the wedge lock, you'll notice inside a couple tabs. All that needs to be done is using the flat end of the screwdriver or of the removal tool is to depress the tab inside the connector and pull the wire. Once you have that depressed, the wire and the contact will come right out. Removing the wedge lock from the receptacle side of the DT connector is just as easy as the plug side. Take the hook end of the contact removal tool, insert it into the wedge lock, turn it so that it hooks and just give a slight tug, and that will pull the wedge lock right out. As you've seen, Deutsch connectors are extremely easy to work with. Don't forget that the pins work with the receptacles, the sockets work with the plugs. For more wire, cable, and hose management solutions, be sure to visit us at wirecare.com.